My name is Lamar Candy. I will be presenting uh, today's study. If you have any questions, you can look at the published paper or contact our team. Their information will be available at the end of the presentation. We'll be going over the introduction, literature review, methodology, results and evaluation, and then finally conclusion. Um, pneumonia is a prevalent life-threatening disease of the lungs. With common symptoms like cough, chest pain, and difficulty breathing, pneumonia can be extremely hard to diagnose with, very, with varying opinions from medical professionals. With chest x-ray often being used to diagnose pneumonia, our research seeks to leverage machine learning models to streamline the process of diagnosis and greatly reduce the risk of human error. Um, here are literature reviews. Most current approaches for <clears throat> focus on extracting images, extracting features from the entire uh, CRX image, which often contains significant amounts of irrelevant information that affects the model's performance. Our project seeks to address these gaps by developing an accurate model with high prediction accuracy, features using features extracted only from the segmented lungs. Our framework works by, uh, by taking the CRX image and segmenting the lungs into a binary classification and the gray image, extracting morphological and texture features. It then splits the data into an 80% training set and a 20% testing set, finally using classification models to uh, produce the final predictions. Our data set includes AP chest x-ray images from patients aged one to five uh, from the Guangzhou Women and Children's Medical Center using 1,565 images of normal lungs mixed with 1,232 images of lungs with pneumonia. We've used a special kind of neural network known as a unit. This model was already trained and customized specifically for lung segmentation tasks in X-ray images as described in the 2022 paper by Arjuna et al. Uh, our model focuses on the morphological features, i.e. the structural characteristics of the lungs and the texture features, i.e. the pixel intensities used to quantify changes in the lung density. <clears throat> ANOVA was used when the target variable is categorical and the features are numeric. REF or recursive feature elimination works by removing features uh, recursively and then building a model on the features that remain. And finally, a uh, correlation coefficient is a statistical measure that quantifies the strength and direction of the relationship between features. Um, here's a graph illustrating the correlation coefficient with strong negative correlation in blue and strong positive in red. Um, and another diagram for by variate analysis. As you can see, uh, pneumonia often is lower than normal lungs. Uh, selective features include the axis major, uh, major and minor length, solidity, extent, correlation, and angular second moment, or ASM. Uh, our modeling works by using a grid search to identify op optimal hyperparameters. Each model executes this task 10 times, then calculates the average metrics. Uh, this is how it calculates and uh, processes it uh, to get the final prediction. And as you can see, this is the 
uh, comparison of metric models uh, that all average around the same with the highest performance coming from the random forest model and the XG boost. Uh, this is like a visual representation of how our models distinguish normal from pneumonia. Uh, to conclude, our, pro our project aims to leverage the power of machine learning uh, and statistical analysis to select features of chest X-ray images. Uh, the highest accuracy is 86% achieved by the RF algorithm, closely followed by XG boost. With an accuracy of 85, these outcomes indicate our approach's effectiveness and distinguishing in distinguishing normal and pneumonia CRX images. Nevertheless, it's important to acknowledge uh, certain limitations as our project focuses solely on pneumonia cases, excluding other lung diseases. Um, thank you for your time. And here are our references and our team's contact information if you have any questions.